And you know what that means? It means it's time for motorcycle season. And do you know what that means? It means I need to build a shed right here to store my motorcycle. I got my shovel. Here I go. Okay, well, hold on, Deanne. Oh. Hi, my name is Douglas Lapp. How are Doug, you? Nice to, nice meet, to you. meet you. I'm with the Ontario Regional Common Ground Alliance. Right. And the Ontario Regional Common Ground Alliance is an advocate for safe digging practices. I see you're going to be starting to, to, to dig here. I am going to start to dig, and, and you're stopping me. I'm stopping you because I wanted to make sure that you called for locates. Called for locates. I did not. Do you know what calling for locates? I means? don't know, and I should know because I have a dig you safe have shirt a dig on. Safe shirt on. <laughs> so so what tell I'm, me what that is all about, Doug. So what you need to do is find out where all the underground pipes and wires are that service your house, because if you dig and you hit them, then you'll cut them and potentially cause a hazard. So, for instance, you have a gas meter here, which has an underground pipeline okay. that goes from the street to your house that heats your house. You also have an electrical box over here, which yeah. has an electrical cable from the street that provides electricity. You also have a phone and potentially a cable line all underground that you need to know where they are before you start. So well, you need to call, and the number you call is the Ontario One Call, which is the service that will actually provide the uh, notification to the to the company that will come and show you exactly where all the pipes and wires are. April is designated as dig safe month because traditionally once the snow melts and the sun, the sun comes out people start to think about digging gardens or fences or putting in new sheds for right. motorcycles. So even if I'm gonna dig my garden I should be calling just to be yes. on the safe side? You should always call before you dig or click before you dig because you can do it online as well and it's a very important service because you need to do it because of the law. You, in order, before you're excavating, you have mm -hmm. to call so that the utilities can come and locate where their pipes and wires are before you dig so you won't hit them. Now, how far below the ground are these pipes and wires? It depends on what the service is. Some of them are deeper than others, but mm -hmm. cables such as your, your cable TV or your phone line could be as less as a foot down. Oh my gosh, are you and serious? And the gas line a couple of feet down. So you need to make sure you know where they are. So you have to be very careful and try and stay away from them. Let's say I didn't call and I'm digging my shed. My gas line is here. I hit the gas line. What could potentially happen here at well, my home? Well, if you hit the gas line, you could cut the line and then the gas would be leaking and, mm -hmm. and potentially cause a hazard because gas is an explosive, it can be an explosive mixture, yeah. and if it does uh, ignite, then it's obviously gonna be a, a, a safety concern. Right, so for me to call, what is the process in that? I just call or I go online and I click, and then what happens next? Yeah, so what they will do is they will contact all of the utilities within that are serviced in this area, and they will find out which ones have servicing in the area, and they will come out and provide a what's called a locate, where they'll come and mark the, the pipeline or the wire on the ground with either paint or flags, mm -hmm. and then you'll know exactly where they are. They'll also give you a piece of paper that tells you exactly where they are. Now, does that cost anything for me to do? No, this is a free service. Nice, free, I like. <laughs> and it's something that's very important, and you should actually be calling at least five days before you're digging, because okay. that's the requirement is that the uh, utilities provide that locate within five days of you calling. So dig safe month is happening. Today is also kind of a special day because there's going to be a flag raising at City Hall here in Barrie. Yes, so the, the mayor of the city of Barrie is going to declare April as uh, dig safe month. He's mm -hmm. going to make a proclamation and raise the dig safe flag at City Hall. Uh, which is being done basically across most municipalities across Ontario. Okay. Um, but we're very proud to be uh, here with the city of Barrie and the mayor to, to proclaim April as Dig Safe Month. Well, Doug, I'm so glad that you were walking by and you caught me before I started digging my shed. I am too, for sure. I really appreciate it. So there you have it. It is Dig Safe Month. Call or click before you dig. Doug. I'm already tired. I think you should take over okay, for me. Okay, I'll take over. I'll take this. You'll take that. Please. How about you start digging there? I'm not going to dig until you get your locates. See? That was a trick question. You passed. High five. All right. All right. Thanks, Doug. Okay. <laughs>